Right, so the next one that we're going to cover, this is a bit of a tongue twister, Religious by Bill Mayer. Mayer. Bill Mayer. <laughs> um, right, so this one, guys, before we even go into it, Ooh. it is it's always a bit of a funny one, religion, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. Ooh. I mean, I'm not, I, I'm, I'm spiritual, I wouldn't say I'm very religious. My family are very religious, so it's a bit of a, mm. so hopefully none of my, none of my family is going to watch this and see me saying that. I really have a good Christian girl, as far as they're concerned. But religion is a very controversial subject, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it is. And it's, it's a bit of a one to go into, I and mean, it's kind of, you're not sure whether you're borderline in offense or not offending That's I mean it. at Dell we actually weren't actually trying to offend anybody mm. by doing this one mm. we were just doing it because we just like to have topics mm -hmm. and I think every, freedom of speech is a fantastic thing and mm. I think everyone's entitled to their opinion mm. I don't think anyone generally unless you're a bit loopy goes out there to hurt people through their religion mm. but everyone has their own opinion yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. you know religions are one of these things it's very personal. Yes. It is. It's I very think, personal. I, I find religion so personal. You've got to understand that not everyone thinks about religion like you do. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And I think I think it was just good actually the documentary because it was telling mm. it from a different sp yeah. perspective that mm. I don't feel has been told very often. And it okay. was kind of from that um, a non-believer standpoint, you know, and. Atheist, and 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 it was. I think the way he, the documentary was done was really well mm -hmm. and, uh, and challenging. Kind of all religions. Mm -hmm. It wasn't. It wasn't like. I mean, it, was it, yeah. it wasn't like Christianity or, oh, or, really? or Islam. It was. It was challenging every religion, and I and I think that was where he was quite good in it. And he, he got himself into a lot of trouble. He, he, he wasn't. Yeah. But yeah. he wasn't from the from the beginning aggressive in no, his challenge. But he, he was wasn't. basically saying, as a non-believer, I find. These this questions. aspects of it really yeah. hard to understand. Mm -hmm. Explain it to yeah. me. That was what he was saying. Yeah. See, I mean, as I say, I haven't had the um, moment to watch it yet, but I find that really odd when you go to people and with their religions and you say explain it and they get very offensive about it. Mm. And nine mm. times out of ten, cannot it actually explain mm. why they're into the religion that they're into? It's true. Yeah. Mm, that yeah, is so true. true. You know, they can't. That was in every single was it? interview that he yeah, did. Exactly. And yeah. As, yeah. as a way of life, yeah. I personally, for me, I mean, I do. It, so I've, I live in a funny household. My son is Catholic mm. because his dad's Catholic. He goes to a Catholic school and he's brought up in a Catholic way. Mm. I myself am Buddhist. <laughs> Are you a Buddhist? Oh, I myself a Buddhist. Okay. <laughs> yeah, my sister and mum are Buddhist. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. I myself a Buddhist, and I've been studying for about the last three years. Mm. And people don't seem to understand. And when they talk to me about things, I'm very open-minded. Like, you know, your religion, your thing. Mm. You do what you like. Mm. You know. But for me, I think your religion should be your way of life, not just something that you do on a Sunday or on a certain day of the week, or pray five times a day mm. and then don't believe in what you're actually praying to. If that makes sense. Mm. Yeah, for me, yeah, I think so. I think, you know, when they say, if you're a Christian, you've got to go to church every Sunday. Now, mm. if you can't go to church every Sunday, mm. does this mean you're not a Christian? Does this mean you can't pray wherever you are? Mm. Those sort of questions were the kind of questions that people used to ask. Mm -hmm. And I don't think, do you have to go to church to be a Christian? Do you have to go? If you're a you Catholic, know? you do. Yeah. If you're a Catholic, they say to be a practicing Catholic, you have to go to church my, every week. My pre, my mum was ill uh, mm. when when I was younger, and the priest would not come out to the house to her to give her communion. She had cancer, and she was having very aggressive mm. chemotherapy, wow. and he wouldn't come out to her. My dad left her at this point, and he absolutely said to her that she could never marry again in Catholic church because she would be a divorced woman despite the fact that it wasn't <laughs> her choice <laughs> he left you know she was he, everything and you just think how is that Christian in any way shape yeah. or form but it's uh, not to, I mean I this is just my personal belief as I said my son's Catholic so I have no issue but I mean it's even a, you know at school you'll do something mm. and they'll say oh that's not very Christian of you mm. wow. and then he'll come home and say such and such did this and I was like, but well, that doesn't sound very Christian, does it? Did you say that? And they say, no, because I'll get into trouble. And I'm like, eh. for me, there's certain contradictory things about being a Catholic or about religion. Mm. But I will, I will point out that I think having some kind of structure in your life mm. is lovely mm. because the structure in the way that he's brought up Catholic has made him a very well-rounded, grounded person. Yeah, yeah. And I went to a Catholic school, and I think yeah. it was... I think more religion more can do that with morals. I, yeah. My biggest thing with it is, I think, rather than bring people together, mm. it divides people. Mm. Yeah. And I think that this is the massive thing, is because everyone gets into their belief system, and this is what it is, mm -hmm. and I believe this, no, but I believe this, and, and I think there is this, my thing is right, your thing is wrong. Mm. That's yeah, my that's biggest thing. It, it creates that divide, yeah. and I, I think that maybe 
rather than turning into religion before our moral standing, we maybe need to turn somewhere else for it, for that structure. It's That's also like if you look at America now, it's scary because there are certain states where they absolutely live by what they de 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 define mm. as mm. their religion. religion. Mm. You know, laws effectively. Mm. Just look at North Carolina, mm. and, and you, you know that's. Current. Like scary. But I think it's massively scary because it's not. It used to be that the church did define, you know, laws were governed by the church back in the olden days. But now we have a different political system. Mm. Yet in some places, it's still the church which is defining. But, but do you think that because they are trying to force disbelief on each other people? Yeah, that's what put, I think putting all the problems mm. out there is that you're forcing your belief on, on someone else. else. Mm. And I think that's what. When you go outside and you see the Christians, they try to talk to you about religion, mm -hmm. and they don't understand that you're not interested. I, I am a Christian, let me just say, and I am, um, I'm a believer, and I love Jesus, and I, I have my own reasons and my own beliefs, my own personal reasons why I do believe, mm -hmm. and so. You know, it takes. I it mean, takes. I think what we're saying is each to our own. Unfortunately, we're running out of time now. Yes. <laughs> we could go on about this yes. all, all day. All day. Oh, yeah. day. Yeah. But what we will do oh. is, if you want to go onto our um, Facebook, which is um, delvemagazine.tv, you'll be able to watch Limit Religious and the other two ten parts. Um, ten parts yeah, <laughs> and the other two. Um, YouTube videos as well. So I'm Emma Louise. This is um, the presenters from delvemagazine.tv. See you next month. Bye. 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 Bye.